Over the last two years, 4Play users have clicked this button over 2 million times, building the largest community ad library in the world. Today, we are shipping the largest update to our Chrome extension since it launched, introducing version 2.0 of our Chrome extension. First, let's start with the little blue button. We are obsessed with how to make this the fastest and most intuitive way to save ads. And it's more than just a fresh coat of paint. When you click the dropdown, you're now instantly focused onto the search bar so you can start typing without another click. Within the results, you now have your starred boards and folders displayed in the list. We also added the ability to save a single ad to multiple boards from the extension. Once saved, there's also a direct link back to the asset in Foreplay so you can add tags and comments. Now we heard from customers that they are accidentally saving the same ad as their colleague. To avoid duplication across a team, the extension will now check if anyone on your team has saved this asset in the past and will display the green save button with the link back to Foreplay. Now let's move on to your new floating sidecar. You will see that there's a new floating Foreplay logo that you can drag or reposition where it fits best. Once clicked, it will launch your new sidecar, unlocking more features and more data. Specifically, when you're in the Facebook ad library, it will display the brand that you're currently viewing. Beneath is a card that shows how many ads the community has saved from this brand. You can also add this brand to Spider directly from the sidecar. The landing page dropdown will display the distribution of landing pages they are currently running. And the media mix will do the same for ad format. Under the board dropdown menu, you can also update your default board. This means if you're working on a specific project, range saving ads, you can update the dropdown across the entire page rather than needing to select the same board over and over again. You can also create new boards in folders directly from the extension. The platforms dropdown gives you quick links directly to the places that you do your ad research and you can get support directly from within the extension. The last feature inside Sidecar is a history feed. This will show you every ad you have recently saved in chronological order. From here, you can copy the share link or link back directly inside of Foreplay. The sidecar is the most feature rich when using it on the Facebook ad library, but it works across all platforms you use with Foreplay. Speaking of platforms, now that we have a more robust foundation for the extension, more platforms are coming soon. This includes Instagram Organic on Desktop, Google Transparency Center, YouTube InFeed, LinkedIn Ad Library, and the Pinterest Ad Library. Because this is such a major change to our core functionality, the new version of the extension will be launched as a public beta before rolling out on the Chrome Store. If you'd like to try out the new version of the extension, there will be a link in our release post. Until next time, stay hungry and get creative.